Hello, I'm David. Hi, I'm Julie. So now we're going to do a how to play and playthrough of Minecraft Heroes of the Village, a Minecraft family game by Robinsberger. And it's ages seven and up, two to four players. And it takes about 20 to 25 minutes. Mm. I think it takes a little bit longer than that, especially if you have more players. I, I think it would. Right. Uh, so this is a cooperative game. My favorite. And you're racing to build three buildings before the illagers over on your village. So let's take a look at the setup. So here's the pieces you're not gonna play with. Each player will have a player board. I have mine upside down, I just oh. noticed. <laughs> and you'll see it comes in two parts. You have your pet companion on one side and your, uh, your character on the left side. Now, each character has, their boards are the same, but the pets will be different. So you, even though it's, what did it say, two to four players? I think that's what I saw. Yeah, even though it's two to four players, you get extra pieces here to pick from. Well, that's nice. Enough for, you know, six different choices. And you have your, your stand here. So you'll put your character and your pet in one of these stands so you can see that I'm this person and my pet is the cat, which I'll explain that's what that so is in cute. a moment. And Julie has the fox, okay? And so uh, there are other pets that you can get. There's a Yama, a horse, a panda, and I think that's the dog. So we're gonna push those off to the side because we're not playing with those. Okay. You can see there's player boards for those players as well. Uh, and we're gonna play the most difficult setting. Mm -hmm. We wanna show, because playing on setting here where you have these three buildings you need to build to win the game, you don't need as many blocks to do it. So that's, you need two wood, two sandstone, and a redstone, three rock and a sandstone, two wood, a sandstone, and a rock. So this is, this is good to play the first time, mm -hmm. okay? But we want to show you the hardest level. Mm -hmm. Here's four, five, six. You can see there's six to five stones you got to use. And here is the hardest level. So we're putting those off to the side. You got to use six, Six seven. and seven. Yeah. And you can complete these in any order and you can work on multiple buildings at the same time. And when you when you get blocks, you'll be putting them on here. Uh, so we're playing at the hardest setting, seven, eight, nine, and then you'll see these clear stands here. This will be used that when you do complete a building, you'll put it in the village right here. But I haven't flipped it over yet, so you have no <laughs> context for that yet. I thought something looked right. different. <laughs> so here's the bag that we'll be putting blocks in. And here is a starting tile. And it says right here on the back, and this is why I wanted to show you this, because it refers to it in the, in the rule book. It says, look on the back of the village tile. Well, if you already have it like this, you're not gonna see the back. So you're gonna put in a rock, a sandstone, a wood, and a darkness. So darkness is bad, you don't want darkness. Mm -mm. And so you connect it here with the Illager's track. And the Illager's track, you're gonna put darkness on five, six, seven, which means when the Illager's get to seven, six, and five, they'll be putting darkness in the bag. And when you draw darkness, you don't want that because then mobs will appear. Here's the mob stacks here. So for the regular one, you play on the nine. You put the illagers on here. And the more difficult, an easier one, you can put them on 11. So you could play really easy here, uh, buildings one, two, three, and put the illagers on 11. But we're gonna put them on nine and it's not too clear in the rules. We're, we're assuming that when the Illagers pass one into the village that you lose. It doesn't say in the rule book if they land on one or have to pass one to win. So we're playing, uh, the, we're interpreting it as that they have to move into the village, get past the one. So they're gonna be moving down this track and what's gonna make a move every turn, you're gonna be rolling this uh, Illager die so after my turn and Julie's turn, she'll we'll roll this die. If you get this symbol, that means the Illagers move forward one on the track. And, and that's on, so half the time you're gonna get that because it's on three sides. And if you get blanks, they don't move. So that's nice when they don't move. So we roll that at the end of every turn. You're gonna use this fight die when mobs appear that block your ability to, uh, what do they call one. that action? Uh, I want to make sure I get the vocabulary right here. 
when you collect blocks. So you can collect wood on this tile, collect stone on this tile, and collect sandstone here. But if there's a mob, and I don't want to turn them over because they're going to have different strengths. Well, I'll turn over one. This mob has a strength of five or six. Oh boy. Okay. So that means that that mob is going to block your ability to uh, collect blocks on there. And how do you get them? Well, when you're collecting blocks, you're going to draw out of the bag. And if you get a darkness, a mob appears here blocking you. Uh, and so then you're going to have to do an action to fight them. And you'll have three chances on the die. So here are the... So when you fight a mob that's blocking your ability to collect blocks there, you'll see there's a five, a six, and a four. And you only... In that particular mob, you have to get a five or six. So you have three chances to roll a five or a six. However, while you're trying to roll that five or six, if you roll this, the illagers move one on the tracks. That's bad. However, if you roll this, they move back one. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you can get the illagers. It says here the illagers are intimidated. Move the illager piece one space backward. So you do have a 33% a chance. Two sides are that if you roll this, the illagers will move back uh, one space. Now, the possibility is you can roll this die three times and still not defeat it, and that's okay. You just have another turn to try again. Uh, so we have our, our character and our companions. We put them in the center of the village. We're playing with seven, eight, and nine uh, buildings. The illagers are going to start on nine. We have the three darkness blocks here. We put the starting blocks in here, which in case you don't remember, that's and you're allowed, it says in the rule book, to look in the bag at any time for what's in there. And now the other part of setup is you have world tiles here. You have 18 of them. And you'll see that there's, when you explore, you get to reveal these. You can get sandstone, you put them in the bag. That's what that bag symbol means. That would be a, a, a wood and a, I'm sorry, that's a redstone that goes in the bag. This is a, a wood and a sandstone that can go in the bag. And there's even some tiles where you can even put three tiles. That's a really good one. Mm -hmm. So you, you randomize this, you mix them up, and you're going to make th three draw piles of six. Because one of the actions that you can do in the game is to explore and reveal one of these. And when you reveal one of them, you, you draw a tile. And I have... Okay, i got to do this without looking. Three, six... So if I move here, I can reveal a world tile in adjacent, not diagonal. I can put one here, here, or here. And then what will happen is I would put it here, here, here. I'd put a stone and a wood in the bag. And then I'd flip it over. Now this is just part of the world, but sometimes you can get places to uh, collect more blocks. Okay. So here we go. Here's our piles of world tiles. And you can choose any pile you want to. I think I have too many in this one. Yeah, it looks bigger than the other one. Okay. Well, it looks like I made it harder here. I'm going to mix this up right now. Okay. Here. Okay, I'm not going to look. <laughs> I'm not looking either. Okay. All right. So we have three piles of six world tiles each. We start in the center. Mm -hmm. uh, we have our extra blocks off the side here. This is for the green player. We're not playing oh, with the green yeah, player. Okay. We have all the mobs upside down here. Mm -hmm. uh, now, I'm going to go over the, the actions you can take in a minute, but let me explain what our our uh, our companions do, our pets. And you can see there's six of them, and it talks about it right here. But let me uh, read to you what each of our pets does. Uh, it actually, it wasn't a dog. It was a wolf. Yours is oh, a wolf? No, the one that I showed. I th oh. I thought this was a dog. It's, it's a wolf. Well, it okay. is the same family. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. All right, so you, uh, I have the cat. You have the cat, and I have the yeah. fox. The cat, a player performing a collect block action, is protected from the effects of the first darkness block they draw. Because when you're collecting blocks and you draw darkness, that means a mob appears and, prevent, and, and blocks you from mining there until you fight the mob off. So I get to ignore one darkness block. But nice. if I get a second one... Say you have I, to keep that. I have to keep the second one. Now the fox... When Julie does a collect block action, she may keep one additional block of any material that doesn't match the collect the symbol. So what does that nice. mean? When Julie, if Julie moves here, and she's drawing for stone, 
The way it works is you draw three, you get to draw three blocks and you're taking the collect block action. So she draws three out of the bag. She didn't get a stone. But her ability is she gets to collect, she gets to collect one additional uh, block that's not part of the type she's going for. So she can keep the sandstone and wood. Now, if she had collected this, let's say, she can keep the stone because that's where she's at. And let's say she had drawn two stone, she can keep all the stone. Uh, that's for anybody, by the way. But she can keep the stone and then she would keep the wood because that's her ability. Now, but the darkness would pop up and then you put a mob here. Mm -hmm. And so now she, somebody would have to take an action to fight off that mob. She would keep, she puts it on her player towel here, the stone and the wood. The darkness goes back in the bag, which can mean it could be drawn again. Uh, so when you're drawing from the bag, doing a collect block action, you draw three from the bag. Darkness makes mobs appear. You can only keep the blocks that match the type you're going for unless you have Julie's pet. Now you are limited to what you can hold until you go build a building. So on these three spots, you can have a darkness, a wood, a sandstone, or, or a rock. And here you can have redstone. Only redstone can go here. Uh, now how do you get darkness? Well, when you defeat a mob, you get to draw three blocks. And you can keep a darkness that you draw and put it on here and it becomes a wild block. You can use it for any type of block that you want to. So let's say we're trying to complete this building here and we need two, two wood and we have the sandstone already there and the two rock and the one, I'm sorry, we have the, yeah, we have the two rock and the sandstone and the redstone, but we only have one wood. We could use a darkness to be a wild for the wood. And again, you're only going to get to put darkness on your tile if you defeat a mob and then you draw it as a reward. Now, if some, at any point you draw uh, from the bag and there's less than three uh, blocks, you only draw what's in the bag. So we're going to have to explore to add more territory to the world to get more blocks in the bag. Okay, and like I said, you can look in at any time. So before we play, let's go over the four actions that you can do. And you can, each character can take two actions. And at the end of the turn, like I said, you're going to roll the, uh, uh, the Illager die. Okay, so uh, explore the world. By the way, you can move anywhere you want in the world. And that's not an action. So I can go here, I can explore, I, can, I could uh, collect blocks. Or I can fight a mob if there was a mob there. So explore the world is one. So I move and then I can reveal a, I can, I'd probably take this one, put it here, here, or here. And then I'd put the blocks in the bag. And then my second action, I can collect blocks. Or if I already had blocks on my tile, I can go here. You gotta go to the center of town to start building these. And then why is this symbol here? It's because when you complete a building, you, uh, move the illager back one space. And so that's one way to ward them off is that you want to complete buildings to push them back one. And remember, you win when all three uh, buildings are created. Uh, one thing I forgot to mention is that when you are drawing out of the bag and you draw a redstone, you get to keep the redstone in addition to what you're going for. Even if you don't have the fox? Correct. Okay. So anybody, so for you, mm -hmm. you could have a situation like this where you draw all three of these and you were mining for for uh, uh, for stone. And I get to keep all three. You would get to keep all three. Wow. Everybody gets to keep the redstone. You get to keep the the stone because that's what you're going for. Mm -hmm. And then you get to keep an additional one because of your pet. Oh, awesome. Okay. okay. Uh, but that had to be drawn out of the bag. Not, there's no redstone in the bag yet. Ah, okay. All right. So we got explore the world where you can reveal tiles and put and put blocks in the bag. That's why you want to do that. Collect blocks, which is basically mining. Uh, you can fight a mob there, which means you roll the dice three times, up to three times to defeat them. And if you defeat them, you can draw three blocks and get to keep one as a reward. Uh, and then you can build. You have to go to the center of town, and you can put blocks on here. You can work in all three buildings at once, or one building. Uh, it doesn't have to go in any order. And when you complete a building, you push back the illagers one space. Okay. Uh, so you can look in the rule book here for what other uh, Rather pets too. I know it's hard to see, but there's other abilities so it adds a little They're more cute. variety to the game. They're really cute. Okay.
So let's play. All right, let's play. So we each get two actions. Okay, you can go first, honey. Okay, I'm going to go here. I'm going to yeah, definitely. Uh, do that. I get a stone, wood, and a sandstone. Okay. Uh, is, is that rock? I should use the correct terminology. <laughs> what does it say, what they call that? Uh, yeah, it's stone. Stone? Okay. And sand. It's sand. Oh, I've sand? Been, I've been calling it sandstone. So okay. rock, sand, wood, yeah. and red. All right, so I flip it over. Okay. Okay, it's oh, just cute. a place. You, can, you know, again, you can move to anywhere you want, so I put it in the bag. Now, I already know what's in the bag here. If I want to, I could mine for stone, because I know mm -hmm. there's two in there. There's two of everything in there now. Or do I reveal more to help you? I think I'll reveal another one. All right. Okay. Because we don't want to draw darkness. No, we don't. Okay, so I revealed one here in this spot. Now, I could reveal another one right here on my next turn. Uh, but that's all I'm going to do. I have my two actions were drawing blocks. So that way Julie will have a better chance of drawing something we need instead of drawing the darkness. All right. Okay, and then now I roll the Illager die. And fortunately, they move one forward. Oh, darn. Your turn. Okay, well, I'll go here. And I'll get, try and see if I can get sand. Okay, let's take a look at what we need. We need one, two, three, four, five sand eventually. Yeah, I know. By the way, when you, when you complete a building, the blocks do not go back in the bag. The only time something goes back oh. in the bag is when you draw darkness. Right. Darkness, will, when you draw it for a mob, it goes back in the bag. Okay. But once you complete a building, it stays out. It doesn't go in the bag. Okay. So are you going to going to draw? Yeah, and then I'm going to try for two two sand. Okay. Well, there's at least... But I draw three, you said, right? Yeah, you draw three. I draw three. So okay. hopefully we get lucky here. Oh, poo. Okay. Well, with your ability, you do keep the sand because that's what you went for. Right. You get to keep an additional block. I'll say keep the stone. But we got a mob. Darn it, Jim. And that goes back in the bag. And so flip one up. And it's one of the hardest ones. It's a six. Because there's only a six on the fight die. Only one six. So that's a hard one to defeat. So right now, our ability to get sand is being blocked by that mob. Well, I think I'm going to fight it. Can I fight it? Oh, yes, but keep in mind. Yeah. You have another action. That would be your last action if you want to do that. I do. I'm going to try. Okay, roll over here. Oh, you got lucky. So now, Julie gets to draw three blocks. And darkness is not bad to draw in this case. All right. Bring on the so darkness. The mob was defeated. We got lucky. Woo Can you do it on camera, please? Oh, sorry. <laughs> All right. Uh, you can't see the dark one because it's so black on the... the yeah, we can put it right, right here. Uh, so it says defeating the mob. Select one block from the three. Now, if you take the darkness, it takes it out of the bag, and you can use it as a wild. I'm going to take the darkness. And you're filled. So next yep. turn... I'm going to go and start putting things down. Right. Now these go back in the bag. Oh, okay. Okay. I was ready to put them out there. Thank right. you for doing so, that. So, obviously, when you draw out of the bag, anything you don't take goes back in. That, I should have said that. No, you're done. No. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Okay. Oh, Unf darn. Unfortunately, they move forward. Oh, shoot. And we got another Sorry darkness in the bag. Well, that's the way it goes. Chewy. So they're advancing. Yeah. What are you going to do, my love? Uh, I can mine, too. We need stone as well. Mm -hmm. But... When you also need redstone, unless, you, unless you're going to use that I'm darkness I'm going to use the as darkness well. as a red. Well, you can hold on to it, too. Yeah. Well, I'm going to mine for stone. Okay. Good luck. Oh, wow. Nothing. Terrible draw. So you don't get to keep any of that, correct? No. Okay. I'm going to do my next action and draw. Okay. I don't have your ability. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Dang it. Oh. Uh, Maybe we're not, maybe it was a bad choice. Yeah. I got a four, five, six. That's easy to defeat. Yeah, you can. You do only that. need to draw a four, five, or six. You okay. can. But my turn's over. I only got one stone. And here's the, the little I white draw, guy. Roll for the Illagers. Oh gosh darn. Maybe we're gonna lose this game. We might. We did win. Barely won the first. We barely time. won the first time we played it with the hard okay. setting. Okay. I'm All gonna right, go here. Turn. Yeah, because you got to clear your board. And I'm going to, what do you think, honey, this one? doesn't matter. Okay. Six is easier than the seven. Okay. So, and then you could use the wild for the redstone. Sure. Let's or do Or we that. can use it for whatever we want. We'll just put comes. it on there for now. Okay. 
So that's your first action is building. Yes. What else are you going to do? Uh, let's see. I think I'll go here and see if I can get some wood. Well, we can fight the mob and try to get rid of a darkness. Okay, I'll do that. I had such better good luck last time. You did. Okay. Because there's two darkness in there now, and it's good to get rid of that. Hopefully I get them. Okay. Oh, look at that. Can you put it over here? Please? Oh, yeah. All right. So you get to keep one. Okay. And so we did get rid of one darkness. That's good. I don't get now, to keep the other one, right? No. Okay. You only get one. One. So that's what's in the bag. You get to look. A lot of wood and sand. I'm glad that they don't make you have to, like, okay. try and remember roll the what's in there, because I would never remember. And then we got another Shoot. darkness. So all the darkness is, is in play. Poo. Uh, okay, sweetums, what are you going to do? Our, we got to complete a building. I know we do. Quickly. We need another... I'm going to reveal a, another world. Okay. What so, was it? Oh, sand wood and sand. And wood. Okay. Okay. And then I'll just go for wood. Yeah, I would. Because we need two wood. Oh, wow, terrible draw. Darn it, Jim. <laughs> We're just not getting lucky. And so we got, wow. How big is that one? A six? A six. Oh, jaw. Bluey. Okay. Oh, thank so goodness. That's good. Woo. All right, your turn. All right. Well, we already have that. You need to get wood because I, I, I have wood. the I have the rock. So that means I have the to go over there and defeat them, right? Yeah, you would. All right. Let's do it. Oh. it okay, you get two more rolls. Okay, try again. They move back one. Well, that was good. But you want to try again? Because we got to be able yeah. to get to the wood. Okay, move back one again. Try again. Got two more rolls. Didn't do it. Didn't do it. Darn it. Okay, roll the Illager die. Okay, good. They didn't move. No. I'm going to try now. Okay, good luck. Yes. Got him. Okay, so my that was my fight action. Great job, Ed. I roll, I draw for a reward. Okay. Yeah, I'm taking that. Heck yeah. Now, you can't place the darkness on the red stone. See, that's, oh. it doesn't have the symbol there. Right, right. Okay. I saw that. Okay, my third action is I'm going to... You mean your second action? Yeah, second action. <laughs> I'm going to draw for wood, uh, try to get some wood. Okay. Yay, yes. and I get to keep both. Only problem is I don't have space for both. Oh, no. Bummer. See, so I can't put it there. Right. All right, I'm done. Okay. Right, back on the six. Your turn. You can draw for wood. Yeah, I will. So Julie's doing a collect block action. Well, you got one, and you get to keep an additional one, so I guess um, keep the sandstone. Okay. Or better yet, you can keep the stone, because you, you will be able to complete it. And then now I'll come here. Yeah, your second action is to build. And then I'm going to build. Got a wood. A wood and a... Okay, so let's see what we got here. I don't know if I'm supposed to copy the picture or what I'm supposed to well, do. Well, it helps to do that. Okay. If we want to use all... We could. Yeah, let's do it. And push them back. Yeah, that's... Not use the wilds. I mean, basically, we're using two darkness to do this. I say we do it. What do okay. you think? Well, let's, let's go for it. Because you've got a, a, a wild over there. Now, I could put it in the stand, but you won't be able to see that we've completed it. So I'm not going to use the stand. Oh, and okay. the blocks stay here. So we push them back one. And that was your second action. So go they don't go. go back in the pile to no. to be picked again? No, it says oh. uh, when you complete a building. Yeah. Uh, the building is complete. Insert it into the base. Place it in the village. Blocks used to construct this building remain where they are and do not go back in the pouch. Hmm. Okay, I'll go here and try and get some... Hey, honey, you're done. You oh, I'm done. Roll, I roll apologize. Roll oh. You collected blocks and it didn't move. Okay, my turn. I was all ready to go <laughs> to go get more blocks. <laughs> I think I'm gonna explore. I think you should. Cause we need more I'll explore here. So it's a nice three of those. An extra thing? Nope, just a picture. 
And then we need to get redstone. We do, but there's no red up there. Dark I'll on it. I'll go over here. Hope we can get one below us. Try the middle one. Okay. Yep. Yeah, there is Ooh. one. There is one coming up. That was a good so guess. So that's a wood. Oh darn. Oops. Hey, and you can mine wood there. Oh, very nice. Another mine. Uh, another clock location. So I'm done. I explored twice, and it, the illagers did not move. Your turn. All right. I think I'll go here and I'll mine Explore. that red. Okay. Is that what it's called? You're exploring. Oh, exploring. Excuse so me. Add red to the bag. Thank you. And now, if you want to go uh, collect, we need I'll go lots collect of sandstone. Them. Okay. That's and fine. we can see how much is in the bag. There's a lot. Oh, the there's a lot we need. Okay, yeah. good. Okay. All right. All right. So you're going to draw three. Okay, you always keep sandstone. Okay. No, I'm sorry. You oh. always keep redstone. Oh. That's what I meant. Okay. <laughs> you got what you got what you tried yeah. to collect, and then you, because of your pet, you get to keep an additional one. So that was a good turn. Sweet. Your turn's done. I'm done. Okay. Now, I don't have enough for that. I don't have another sandstone. I better go build. Okay. So. Let's do this one. Sure. Because we're going to need the wild probably to c complete it. Probably. Do you have any wood? I did. I dropped it off. Nice. So now I will go get... Some sandstone. Uh, I need to get more wood. Oh, more wood. Okay. Go back there for okay. my second action. You got it. Yeah. Good job. Okay, I'm done. Mm. Yeah, I moved on the six. Your turn. Go to drop off stuff. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Okay, so I'm gonna drop off one of those. So you could use the wild for that wood. So we still need, and we can use that for that. Okay. We still need two more wood. I have one. Let's see how much wood's in the bag. All right. There is two wood in the bag. Then I'll go try and get some wood. Okay. You did. And you get to keep all three. Hot dog. Because of your pet. Because oh, you keep me. all blocks you're going for. Okay, they didn't move. We're getting lucky on the dice. Okay, now what are you going to do, sweetie? Well, let's see what's left. Because okay. in the next one, we need sandstone. I'll get this, but we'll get a mob. And that's oh. okay. Might as well do it. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm going for sandstone. <laughs> okay, we've got a mob. But that's okay. It goes back in the bag. Because I don't care if it's blocked. I just want the sandstone. Okay. And I go here and I'll drop it all off. And... I don't think that's complete yet, is it? Not yet. It's almost complete. What is left? You need another wood there. Okay. I'll get rid of these. All right, I'll roll the Elders die. Did you do two things already? Why, it was quick. I collected blocks and then I built. Okay. Okay, it didn't move. Now you need to go back. So now you do the wood. Okay, so we finished it. Mm hmm So this is what we built. This goes back one. Because we use the darkness as a wild. So that's what we built. And they go back one. We'll put it right here to show. And then I'm going to drop off this wood yeah. for this one. Can I trade this in? Oh yeah, you can get rid of it and it goes back in the pile. So it does talk about that. That if you get a resource that you can't use, you can get you can remove it off your board and this goes into the But supply. you can't get one that you want then. No. No. Okay. Okay. So that was one action. Yeah. We need to get more we need to re we we need to reveal uh, explore the world more. Okay, I'm gonna go explore over here. I'm gonna get that red. Can Wait, we don't me? do we need red? Yeah, yeah we do. Okay. So red goes in. And then and that's it, I'm done. Roll the Elder die. Oh, sure. Oh. It's okay, we're doing pretty good. Yeah. Actually. All right, uh, we need more. This is what's in the bag. We need. Oh, gosh, we need uh, another. We just need another stone. Another stone, yeah. But there's nowhere to get it, I don't think. Yeah, I'm going to go here. 
Oh, right here's a stone. Oh, you're gonna. You know what I mean? I'm gonna do this one actually. Okay. Because it's for sure we're gonna get a stone. We don't need another sand. No, we don't. Okay. Mm -mm. So now, knowing what's in the bag, I'm gonna go mine stone. Okay. You know, collect it. My second action. But you also need red too. I know, but you get it automatically when you draw it. Oh, right. I did draw a darkness, but we don't care because it's right there. Now, are you able to complete this right now, or do you have to wait till your turn? I revealed, and then I explored, and mm -hmm. then I collected blocks. Now I roll for the illagers. Okay, they're on five. Now, for you, you can just go get a a, a mob. Okay. Yeah, four, five, six would be good. And you got them. So guess what? What? You get a darkness, and that's a wild. Very nice. Oh, it doesn't go on the sands on the redstone. And you have one more action left. Uh, There's no you more could, blocks on You there, could defeat it. the other mob and hope to push the, the back, but we're going to win. We're going to win anyway, so, so I'm just going to dump. Yeah, I'm done. Okay, roll the elder die. Sure. Okay, you don't move. Mm -mm. I go here. I do the other stone. And the red. And the redstone. So we finish it. We did it. I love com com cooperative games. Yes. And they get pushed back one, and that's it. Yay, we did it. So how many, that was 30, yeah, it was about, mm -hmm. it was about 20 minutes. Yeah. So it's accurate when you know how to play the game. I hope you guys had fun. Okay, so that was, uh, yeah, it says 20, 25 minutes. So that, that was quick. Yeah. So that shows you this is our third time playing it. We're getting better. <laughs> and it goes really fast. But it might go a little slower with three or four players. I think it would. I do. But anyways, uh, please check out our review. Oh, before we go, I have one question. Yeah. Can you play, like if you had all four players, could you play with more of these? Or you only Doesn't play say with that. three? You only play with three. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, that's my only question I had. Okay. All Thanks right. for watching. Thanks for watching, you guys. We'll see you later. All right, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.